Hey guys, it's Di from Bags for Bubbles and today I just wanted to share a quick video on my jewelry area on my dresser. So this is in our master bedroom, you can kind of see in the mirror over here. And I've had this tray for a while and I have a couple of my favorite pictures over there on that side of the dresser. Some of my favorite perfumes in the middle and a champagne candle. But over here on the side I've just been working on this jewelry area and I wanted to share it because I like how it turned out. And I also wanted to share it in case anyone has been looking at these glass jewelry cloches on Pottery Barn's website. I was really kind of on the fence on whether or not I would like it, but once it got here, I was glad that I purchased it. So I thought it might help people to see it in person if you've been debating it as well. So I just have some of my favorite Henry Bendel necklaces hanging from my small mannequin over here, which I believe is from Joann's. And then I also put this necklace on there that my daughter made me for Mother's Day so I like seeing that every day and that's kind of just like a little accent piece on there and then I just got this from Pottery Barn this is the wrist cloche and so the glass just lifts off the top just like a regular one would and it's got this pedestal on there where you can hang different bracelets now the one thing I would say is I just wish that this was a little bit higher so you could put um, longer bracelets on there I originally had planned on putting a large portion of my Alex and Ani collection on there but the Alex and Ani bracelets hang down quite a bit and you can see the bracelets just fit. I just took off some of the Alex and Ani bracelets that I was wearing and you can see what those look like on there so I was kind of hoping that it would be a little bit further up to where the charms would dangle like this like basically if this dip wasn't in there so I may try to alter it at some point and raise this up to where the charms can actually hang there so I can see them and it's a little bit more decorative but that's what it looks like with Alex and Ani charms on there so I think it would be perfect for a watch if you wanted to display a watch and it's really easy to open and get to the items inside but it was advertised as like a watch and bracelet holder. They also have a necklace holder that is taller, about the size of this, that has the cloche on the top of it. And then they also have a ring one that can be monogrammed as well. Then down here I just have a little box. I believe this is from Home Goods. It's just mirrored. I just happened across it one day and I just like the style of the top. It had these diamonds and I just thought it was just kind of a nice accent piece. So that's how I've decided to arrange my jewelry area over here. I wanted to share that real quick and also share what I thought about this jewelry cloche from Pottery Barn. I've been liking it so far. I do wish that the dip was a little bit taller. It was a little bit higher up, but I think that it's a nice piece and I may even try to wrap this with something to make the things hang a little bit higher. But definitely a nice piece. I used a coupon on it so I think with a coupon it's well worth the price. It's heavy and substantial on the bottom and it arrived nicely packaged. So that is it for today. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.